Scaling text manually. To scale the text manually, we're going to have to calculate our scale factor. And to calculate our scale factor, we're going to multiply the paper text height to get um, times our scale factor to get our model space text height. So here we're drawing down in model space. So let's start with an architectural example. Let's say I have my building full scale. And then when I print the building down, that whole, let's say, 68 feet by 46 foot building can't fit on one sheet of paper. That it need a 68 foot piece of paper. So we're going to reduce it down so that each quarter inch on the paper equals one foot in real life. So each quarter inch on paper equals one foot of the building. We're going to call that scale quarter inch equals one foot. To calculate that, we are going to say, what is the scale factor? An easy calculation is, how many quarter inches are there in one foot? Well, there's four quarter inches in an inch and 12 inches in a foot, so that's 48. So our scale factor is 48. So we're going to make our eighth inch size text. That's how big we want it when we print it. We're going to multiply. 8th inch times 48. So an 8th inch times 48 gives us 6 inches. So we're going to make our text 6 inches tall down in our architectural model. Let's say we're doing a mechanical example. If we're doing a one-to-one, -one, let's say the part is going to fit on a sheet of paper, then we make it 8th inch tall. It's simple. It's one-to-one. -one. There is no scale factor. But let's say that for every inch on the paper, it equals four inches long in real life. So that's a scale of one to four. Then our scale factor is actually four. So now our eighth inch tall text has to be multiplied times four, and we'll have a text height of a half inch. So just an example how we manual scale the text so we will have to figure out that text before we start placing our text in the drawing so we know how big the text will be and this is known as scaling the text manually